<laughs> the weekend coming in like a siren. Yes, that's a good way to get you pumped up. And this Saturday, you're going to have your chance to drink with a little small town charm while tasting locally brewed ciders, beers, craft cocktails. It's time for the sip of Julian. It is happening. So this morning we have Emily Hansen with Julian Hard Cider joining us. Good morning, Emily. We're so excited. Good, Good to morning. see you. Uh, so, okay, let's we're excited talk. to be here. Thank you. Uh, first of all, explain where you are and then we'll get into the details of Sip of Julian. So I'm at Winola Pizza. Um, we're in the Red Barn um, behind their beautiful bar here. We're going to um, show you some of our ciders that are um, made in Julian. And we're also going to make a cocktail from Winola Pizza. Oh, very nice. Okay, so I do want to say, Emily, I have Julian Hard Cider here. 100% fresh pressed harvest apple. I mean, apple cider we know is good, so why not make it hard for us adults? Um, I'm gonna pop this top and just join you while you tell us all about it. Tell us about this cider. All right, so um, the harvest apple is made with the champagne yeast. That is the original cider, the first one we started with. Um, and that one is um, very authentic. It's nice and crisp and dry. Uh, everybody loves it. It's a good thing to start with if you have never tried cider before. Oh, nice. Um, I have tried cider before, but I like this one. I'm going to go ahead and take a sip. I don't know if you want to join me, Emily, but cheers to you. Sure. Mm -hmm. Cheers. Enjoy. Oh, my goodness. That is so refreshing. It's hard to believe that it is mm -hmm. hard. I will say that. So that can get a little dangerous, but mm hmm. Mm. That is good stuff. I love it. Yeah, you can really taste that apple in there, which we know you guys are good at growing those. Uh, so, okay, what else do you have? What can we expect? What's Sip of Julian all about? Well, the Sip of Julian, you get to go to about 10 different uh, breweries or cideries um, locally, and you get to get um, a little taste of their special drinks um, or uh, like a little side dish with it as well. So it's a great way just to get an overview of all the businesses and find out what's your favorite spot in Julian, um, and just, you know, see the beautiful atmosphere up here as well. Oh, it's so beautiful up there. And uh, you guys will be serving a special cocktail. Uh, so I know you mentioned that you might be making one this morning. What else are you doing up there? <laughs> uh, well, these um, uh, small batch ciders we have here. So yeah. I'd say the most popular right now is the watermelon cider. Okay. Um, that one will probably be a part of our sip of Julian, but it is delicious. You can only get it at our tasting room mm. um, at the Julian station. So definitely come up to try that one. And then are you going to make a cocktail too this morning? Yes. Okay. So we're going to make, this is for my little pizza. So we're going to make the fighting redhead today. So I'll go ahead and do that real quick. A fighting redhead. So mostly um, <laughs> fill up with ice. And then this is an organic um, house-made strawberry syrup. Okay. Um, has ginger, basil, strawberries, and some organic cane sugar. Oh. So we'll do about that much. Oh. And then I love that combo, fill ginger up and basil. The rest with the Tito's. Tito's, yay. <laughs> So this is at Winola Pizza, that elaborate bar yes. that they have? That's nice. Yeah, it is a beautiful bar, and it is right down the street from our tasting room, so we love it. That's great. That's perfect. So pizza, cocktails. All right. Yeah, all very close. Mm -hmm. I think she's pouring the drink. Try a little bit of everything. There you go. Cheers, so, you guys. Those with that delicious cocktail, and it looks beautiful. Wait, what did you say it was called again? <laughs> The Fighting Redhead, Fighting named redhead. after a beloved worker who used to be here at Wendell Pizza. Oh, that's awesome. I love that. Uh, also, Emily, we should point out this whole event, Sip of Julian, is a fundraiser. Where does the money go to? Um, so this is going to the Christmas tree lighting, which is a very special event for Julian. Um, if you've never been, you definitely have to come. But everyone packs into our little corner where we have our big tree that they light up and Santa Claus visits, um, they usually have Miss Julian and the princess is there, music, hot chocolate, it is a great event. So oh. something definitely to look forward to this year. Yeah, for the Christmas season. We know it's beautiful, uh, you know, the fall and the winter, but now, right now in the summer, it's great to go visit. So we appreciate you. Cheers to you, Emily. Thank you so much. Cheers. Thank you so much. Have a great weekend. <laughs> you too. Hope to see you up there this coming weekend. Eric, I'll send it back to you.